So say our NCM, think of it as if it's a portal into the definition of all these carbon projects and programs that are removing or reducing carbon from the atmosphere. And what's interesting about SIDAR is that it obviously is able to produce incredible amounts of data that explain and define those carbon projects and programs. That's a number of systems are doing that. But it takes the description to another level because what it does, it stands up those projects in the form of environmental attribute units that can be measured today through geospatial technologies. And through the measurement of those environmental attribute units, what you do is you create almost a live form of carbon that can be quantified with degrees of accuracy in AI and ML statistically that are significant. So what that allows you to do is potentially take and own those carbon units and monitor them through the life cycle of the carbon sequestration process. And so a lot of these projects that actually exist out there have certain term definitions or maturity to them. And what SADAR does is it treats those projects as real economic units that are live. And that's been the difficult thing that takes a lot of R&D on to create those technologies. And so our partnerships that we're striking to create those measurements are the ones that are allowing us to stand up that carbon unit.